legally dope by simply holding your breath. Epo is made famous, of course, by the Tour de France. Why was that? Well, it gives you an advantage, not necessarily a fair advantage, especially if you're taking it illegally. But you know your body produces this hormone and you can increase your production of Epo. How do you do that? You can do it simply by holding your breath. This is legal. Doping. If you do a breath hold, oxygen can't get into your body. And during that breath hold, your cells continue to extract oxygen from your blood. And as a result, then your blood oxygen saturation is going to drop. By putting the body into an oxygen dash, simply by holding the breath, you increase your EPO. This sends a message down to the bone marrow. And this increases the production of your red blood cells. Your red blood cells carry oxygen. And now this has increased your oxygen carrying capacity. Your ability to increase EPO is based on your ability to lower your blood oxygen saturation. Can you do it during physical exercise? How many breath holds would you need to do? If you're doing five reps, maybe two sets, maybe a minute or two spaced in between each, that would be enough to synthesize the kidneys, to synthesize erythropoietin. It will take about three or four days to reflect with increased blood cells, but you can legally dope by simply holding your breath.